Hello everybody, I'm Waltraud and I would like to share again my latest project. This time I made a recipe album uh, by following the tutorial by uh, Scrap Queen. That's how she, uh, that's her name on YouTube. And uh, I made, uh, I, I copied her pages in, in there but I made a different kind of binding. She uses elastic strips and I couldn't, I don't know, it didn't, it was so, I didn't like it when I did it. It, it looked different like hers. So I saw, saw them, saw my pages in. I made a flexible spine by, yes, uh, oh, it's too difficult to, uh, for me in English to explain. I scored a piece of paper and Yes, in between there is Tyvek to give it strange so it doesn't tear when the uh, when the pages when they are filled up with all the recipes uh, will be, will become quite heavy so I decided to make a uh, make a Tyvek in between and well and I was lucky to find this old graphic forty five paper collection and a an, uh, scrapbook store in Valencia. I couldn't get all of the uh, of the pages, but uh, enough to to uh, make this album. Uh, and as well, the uh, the uh, how is, is it called the solid and patterns from the uh, of the races. The green and the beige is going very well with the colors in, in the Home Sweet Home collection, so I could could help it out to use this solid and pattern papers from, from the other uh, Graphic 45 collection. Okay, that's the front. And here is my flexible spine, you can see. And that's the back side. I love this paper so much. And now, yes, uh, it will become the, uh, a birthday gift for my sister to, for her 50th birthday. And it's already a, quite a while ago that she asked me to photocopy our mom's uh, recipe book, which wasn't, a, wasn't actually a book anymore, just loose pages and a lot of, I would call it ephemera, like envelopes and uh, shipping notes where she no, uh, she put the recipes on on the back side so i photocopied everything i found in my in yeah in my book and put it in this new recipe book so let's have a look inside it starts on the cover inside it starts with my mom's recipe book or what's left from it and that's really how the original is look, uh, looks like with all these thorn pages and there are half pages in there look at this this they didn't grab it because it's yeah it's impossible and uh, here we have yeah the, the, the back is empty it's, I don't know, there are a lot, a lot of pages missing, but, and I don't know where they're going to. Oh, this is a, is a bitty because I, I brought it to a place so to, to put these uh, things in. And yes, they didn't realize this one look half page in there. So these are what's left and in here in the first page uh, I made the first the first uh, page is the original page from Scrap Green and in this acetate pocket or window pocket there is the first ephemera piece of the I found in my mom's in between the pages of my mom's cookbook Oh, I don't know. It's a, it's a guide to how to use this uh, this pot to make uh, uh, to make uh, cucumbers and stuff in in glasses. So 
So in the, in the middle of this are on each side six pockets for recipes. So I just, uh, you know, I, I didn't put in each pocket the recipe because I wanted to show a little bit of the paper because if you do that, you will, yeah, you will cover up all the paper. Look at that. So, and as long as I thought it's not, it's not, they, it's, uh, I don't use it or she don't use it, we, are, we can leave it like that. So you can enjoy the, the pretty paper. This, by the way, is paper from the, of the races collection and this, this one as well. I made different, I made these cards myself. I made different ones with different uh, images on it. And this is, this is one. This is another one. And olive oil stuff here. Eggs in a basket. Cookbook and uh, pot. And uh, herbs in here. So these are the different kinds. The different ones and in each pocket or in each page sorry there is another image on the back side of the first page i made this deep, deep pocket and diane diane smith is is the name of the uh, of scrap queen made in in her in her book and as well i made one of these little booklets which are house uh, which are housing housing in there on the second page I made my pocket the landscape style and in there is another ephemera. It's a piece of a uh, flower bag and this flower bag had a uh, recipe on from, from, some, from a uh, cake with nuts and this one is a kind of um, shipping note on one side and on the other side, do we have a, uh, uh, does it say um, the day? Yeah, it's from 86. It's not that old. And on the back side, there are, again, recipes. This was a little sheet. And I copied it on tea stained paper to have the back side as well. You looking used. Ah. Yeah, I see. Yes. Here's the middle part with the recipe cards again. And on this on this page, I made a belly band on the back, and there is an original piece of uh, with recipes in there from a from a uh, from a baking paper and yes it's I guess it's from the 70s or in 75 and here we do have uh, the cutter parts and journaling cards I packed on cardstock just because they are pretty in here oh I don't know how you say therefore in this um, pocket there are recipes on the back side of this uh, note papers they in Germany they use them in, in bars to to remember the, the the orders of the customers this is a German brand name brand and on the back side you see the recipes. Okay, so this is again the, the part with the with the twelve pockets for recipe cards, and on the back side another tea pocket with another little booklet in there, same style than the one before empty paper to make your own notes. This is a, a Casey Order calls it a signature cut. Just decorate the paper a bit. In the last page or in the last page pocket I don't have anything. Here is 
one of my favorite papers from the uh, from this paper line with all the vegetables on it again with 12 pockets and on the back side another belly band with some cutter parts journaling cards and a letter to my mother from my cousin and uh, yeah sending recipes for uh, cookies Christmas cookies and on the back some information for the family this is a paper clip I made but it's not easy to, to stick down to stick it down and on the inside cover I made this kind of file folder I found a, a tutorial in English because the the lady who is doing this I don't remember her name because she is French and I don't speak any French then she mainly makes the or the most of the videos she's doing is are in French but I found an English one for this kind of of pockets and I was very happy when I discovered it so I will make a link below in the description box in case you are interested uh, how to make these kind of pockets. And in there is all the rest of this ephemera stuff I found in the in the in the cookbook of or, yeah in the recipe book of my uh, from my mother. Here is an envelope. On the back side there's a re recipe for cookies. Here as well the same inside as well. In case you are interested how they look like, I will make photos of all these uh, ephemera pieces I found in my mom's recipe book. And you can have a look. The ones who are interested can go to my uh, W Design Facebook page and where I will post all this uh, ephemera stuff. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked it. And in case you did, I would be very happy if you give me a thumbs up or maybe you leave me a comment or you share it with somebody else. I thank you for watching and say goodbye until next time.